Alright, hey guys, how's it going? It's all the Angry Nerd again, and today we're going to be playing Silent Hill Downpour. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Subscribe and become a friend today, and we'll see you guys in the video. Stay awesome. Alright, yeah, now we're back with some more Silent Hill. Uh, last episode, we found some stuff about a psychologist. Um, we, what else did we do? We found out um, Silent Hill has been a fucked up place for more than, you know, as long as we've been here, and that's only been a short time, so. And if you guys haven't played the other Silent Hills, it's pretty much like Downpour, but they're, they're a lot better than, I'll be honest with you there. I do like Downpour, but, you know, the, like, as everyone says, the best is Silent Hill 2, and that is the truth. 3 is okay. 4 was pretty good, too. I like how they focus with the cult. And, uh, 5 was good, 0 was good, 1 was good, too. I honestly have, like, no Silent Hill games I don't like, except for the, uh, like, the, the reboot Silent Hill games, like, uh, what was it, it's like Silent Hill for the Wii U, and they did, like, a whole new style of, uh, you not being able to fight anybody, so, you know, it was more or less, like, it felt like I was playing Amnesia, to be honest with you, but with a fucking, like, Wii mode, it, it wasn't that great. And it's like, I love Silent Hill, but, you know, it isn't that great. And what was another Silent Hill game? Uh, there's one for the PSP I never played, but I had a friend who played it who said, um, it feels like I'm playing, like, a dungeon, like, uh, like a dungeon Silent Hill game. And I was like, oh, that sounds cool. And he's like, you can play with friends. And I was like, oh, that sounds cool too. But, you know, that takes away the whole, like, me being scared factor and everything. Because you have a bro beside you. Unless we have a really bad friend who's definitely easy to behind. Could have been my mic too, or my Xbox mic, so whatever. E either way, I took care of it. We are finding all the good shit. Uh, yeah, let's. I, I honestly don't feel like using a gun, I kind of feel like conserving that ammo. There we go. Yeah, there we go, we got Mr. Chair. Oh, oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. I got fucking... I got the, uh... I, I got the Gordon Freeman right here. Okay, every time when I find a crowbar, I'm calling it the Gordon Freeman. Yeah, me, me and Gordon now, we're gonna go check out what the fuck's going on. God damn, I love crowbars in games. Like, it's like the best zombie apocalypse weapon. Like, I'm not saying, like, this type of crowbar, you know, like a hand crowbar, it could be good, but I'm talking about one that's, like, two-handed where you, like, have to use both your hands for it. Like, this is good because it's more, uh, like, you can walk around quick with it, but... Wait, did I be come here already? No, I didn't. Because I have to be in a dumb view. Nobody knows... Oh, hey, we got the slides. Hey, we got the fucking slides. But, uh, yeah. No oh, shit. Uh. Uh, Dr. Wayne Siren, uh, Warden Glenn Milton, to subject, uh, psycholo or psychological evaluation. Uh, subject, hearing, whatever. Uh,. This is a male, 43 years old. He is, he is serving uh, whatever year year sentence for multiple felonies accounting include third degree murder and sexual assault of a child below the age of wow that's fucked up below the age of 14. He appears to be in satisfactory physical health. Oh, great, and fucking Silent Hill decided to turn off again. Alright, people, sorry about that. Uh, fucking... Thanks, Xbox, fucking freeze up my shit. So, I'll be back again. Sorry about that, people. I'm, I'm honest, like, I'm being honest with you, I'm sorry. I'll be right back.